Hello and welcome wherever you're watching around Australia. Paul Peacock, Robbie Slater and Mark Bosnich with you on a Monday evening live on Fox Sports for more A-League action. Miller takes it quickly. It's forward with anyone trucking that run. Back to Piscopo who can hit him. Plays in Davila and chips the keeper. Wellington 1-0. Just like that, their little Mexican marvel scores another for the Knicks. Russell. Beanie in a bit of space all of a sudden. So three on two, he's got Duke for company, Bernie Abini. He goes one on one with McGing into the box. He's got two Knicks players. He does really well with the cross over to Wilbering. Daniel Wilbering, the former ball boy for the Western Sydney Wanderers has got his first ever A-League goal, and it's a big one for the home side. And what a finish at the back post. He just goes it in from his left, from the left-hand side, completely unmarked. Sale just waits for everything to get in order in front of him, and Payne launches it forward to Ball, who wins a really good header, and actually he'll get a second bite at it here. He's got Natter for attention. Back to the Villa and Lewis, who can find McGarry out on the left. Quick ball in. Piscopo looking for the little nutmeg on Bacchus. McGarry, De Villa, Piscopo blocked by Gordon. Out to Devlin. Will he have a go from out there? He will. Oh, what a goal. What a hit from Cameron Devlin. The Knicks back in front with one of the goals of the season. And what a game. Incredible. Ter terrific play. Sets it up. He's got the time to just settle. Oh. And you won't see a, a more pure strike than that. He just gives it violence on the half volley. Tracy's corner. It does find the head of Jordan Much. Again, an equaliser for the Wanderers, this time off the head of their English import. And Ollie Sale could only see it coming to low to his left and he's filthy and his team in front of him. Wanderers right back in it. Rufa had some space and went over the head of Duke who was a little disappointed to see Daniel Wilmering so far back. Big opportunity here for Wellington. Ball, he can feed it in. Piscopo just dwelt on his run ever so slightly and that was the difference between picking the ball up here and picking it out of the back of the net for Daniel Margush, perhaps still alive. Oh, great ball in from Lewis. Penalty. Calmly done. 3-2 Wellington. What a game we have here at Bankwest. And the celebrations begin at the south end. We are looking at one of the games of the season. Fair play, Uli de Villa. There was no histrionics when Hamed went straight over to the ball and picked it up as soon as the penalty was given. And Uli was only too happy to hand it over to a, a confident, fresh player off the bench. The Wanderers, again, with it all to do. Duke! Oh, what a response! This is extraordinary! Mitchell Duke. Wow. Playing the whistle, if you don't mind. It didn't seem to be a lot of contact, and he gets his body position in the right way and dispatched it into the back of the net. Hamed can't quite bring it under control straight away. Stretches for it. He hasn't hurt himself right there. Back it goes for now who bursts free, he's got Muller on his right, Nikolai Muller, the cross back, Yeboah! The Wanderers have done it, for now, there's more to come, but this extraordinary game keeps on going to new levels, Wanderers in front. Well he kept his composure, and again, it's a very, very good finish. Last minute. Hamed again flicks it on, Sotirio, Hamed! To use those famous words in the A-League. Good grief, what a game we've had here at Bankwest tonight. And in the last minute, Toma Hamed has scored his second goal for the club. And Wellington, justifiably, they'd feel, are going to get something out of this classic from the A-League. We've got the calib calibration that's been done across the line. And Toma Hamed is standing there with his arms... And stretch, he can't quite believe that he's been called offside. It's his shoulder. It's 
his left shoulder, which has got him about half a foot, if a little less, offside. Evans doesn't have the whistle in his mouth just yet. Here is the possible chance. McGowan, what a big header that was at the back. Devlin goes charging in. Bacchus is there first, and we're done. Extraordinary game. What an amazing game of football at Bankwest Stadium. When you rock up to a game of football, you hope you're going to get something that you remember for a very long time. Full time at Bankwest, Western Sydney Wanderers 4, Wellington Phoenix 3.